Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another beautiful morning of fresh powder and snow. It's like the fourth or fifth powder day now in a row, and yeah, can't not be feeling this season and how bountiful it has been. Today is a bit of a gamble. It's a bit of a toss-up. Uh, Whistler Black Ohm is claiming that they've got 17 centimeters of new snow overnight, but the freezing level was at 1250. So pretty high up, which means I think it rained on the majority of the mountain. But there could be some really good snow up in the top portion. So I'm really hoping that, uh, yeah, it held out and that there is this 17 centimeters of fresh snow in the top section here. But if not, I'm going to ride just two or three laps before I head back down the mountain and get ready to go into work later this afternoon. That's the one hard thing about such a stormy season, guys. I have been waking up at like 4 a.m. every morning recently just so that I can get prepared, eat breakfast, get on the mountain for 6 a.m. You know, I'm in line at 6 a.m. and then wait around until about 8.15 when the hill actually opens. So yeah, pretty, uh, pretty invested in all of this, but yeah, hard to miss um, any good powder, you know? I definitely sit around at home and just uh, kick myself if I miss a powder day. So yeah, I'd rather just persevere and push through all that tiredness in the morning and get out there and make sure I get the goods. It's a pretty windy day today. I can hear the wind howling. Uh, I'm kind of doubtful that any Alpine will open up super quick, but I think that I can still get my uh, really good first things first morning lap under the peak to peak tram. So that's what I'm aiming for. Really hoping that there's some good snow over there. And yeah, if not, I'll just head back home and get ready for work earlier. Is some of the weirdest snowpack I have ridden. It's like a little bit of powder on top of a layer of crust on top of like a really soft layer. Oh my god guys, this is the weirdest snow I've ever ridden. It's like powder in one stake, but on the other hand it's also kind of icy. It's weird, like your board kind of sinks through that crispy layer and then it almost wants to hook in. So I don't want to lay in my edges too deep because I feel like I'm going to get hooked. Oh man, it's so bumpy and weird. I've never ridden snow like this, especially on a Gentum stick. Oh man.
guys. So that's what they call a one and done kind of morning. Got up super early, got the goods, got that one fresh line, and now I'm headed back down the mountain so I can go into work. A little bit crispy crusty today, but still enough powder to make it worthwhile and to still get those turns. Uh, and it's also proving how versatile this Gentum Stick Superfish actually is. You know, I didn't think it would do any good on a crispier day, but uh, yeah, holding up in the icier conditions way better than I thought. Anyway guys, hope you liked the video. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget to check out the links in the description. We'll see you next time. <laughs>